Hi everybody! We got a bunch of new chicks today from the feed store. They were having half off all of their chickies because they're done with their chick selling season. So went down there and grabbed up all they had left. And I wanted to do just a quick video um, to help people who are new chick owners out um, to help your chicks if they have what they call a pasty butt. And here's what it looks like. Poor little chickie has got a bunch of poo stuck on his butt really simple. They call it pasty butt. Um, it happens when they get the temperature change pretty drastically or when they're shipped in the post office. Um, so, you know, they ship day old pullets and that's usually the most common thing. Uh, it can kill them really quickly. So it's really important when you get your chicks, if you order them in the mail, that you check them all. Um, we just picked up these, like I said, from our local feed store. And this is probably, I mean, we picked up about a hundred, but this is probably the 10th guy I've found who has really bad. Some of them have just a little bit, um, but this guy's got it pretty bad. So really, I mean, you can do it a couple ways, but the easiest way is just a soft cloth. I'm using a paper towel, a bowl of warm water. And you just want to take your cloth put it over the chick's vent because what's happening is their poo is just getting stuck. So every time they poop, it pushes out a little bit more, but eventually what will happen is they won't be able to poop and it will kill them, especially when you're a little tiny chick like that. Uh, so they may not be super thrilled about it. This guy is being really good. This is one of our new golden sex links. She's a pretty little girl. She's going to be a sweet little egg layer. She's got things to say. Man, I just kind of hold it there for a few minutes and wait. You don't really want to pull because the poo is attached to their feathers. And I dip it in the warm water again. Put it back around. Basically, I'm just holding on. I'm just, I'm grabbing on to the ball of hardened poop and just holding it next to the skin. The, you know, as close to the, the skin of the chicken as I can get, because really it's right around their vent. You don't want to pull their chick, you don't want to pull their little chicky feathers out or, or hurt their skin. And as you can see, she's closing her eyes. She's okay. Hopefully she knows I'm doing something good for her. Uh, some people say vegetable oil is good. Um, I personally don't use it, but I'm sure it would work fine. Other people just insist that a q-tip is better because you don't get as much of the bird wet. But these guys are still in a nice warm brooder, so they dry off pretty quickly. And a couple of things that you can do that are helpful if your chickies have, see it's still on there and I've been holding it on there for a few minutes now. The thing you can do that's helpful if your chickies are suffering from pasty butt um, is to put probiotics in their water and also which most, you know, you can get at any feed store. Um, and then um, another great thing is oatmeal, raw oatmeal. But be sure and give them some grits. If you're going to give them anything but baby chick food, um, they're going to need grits to go with it. So I'm just kind of holding around where it's stuck on. And really, it's not even stuck so much to the skin anymore because I've been holding it for a few minutes. It's just stuck to her feathers. You can see. So there's just this big piece of poop and I can kind of pull it. It's kind of making her unhappy. Okay, so it came off. See, there's that. There's a relatively clean chicken bum. I do just take my cloth one more time and just make sure I'm wiping their little vent. Make sure there's nothing left. What you want to see is a nice, clean little chicky bum, albeit wet, but clean. There's little pieces stuck to the feathers. Just kind of gently pull them until they come off. Stuck to the feathers is not really a super big deal at this point. If you've gotten it off the vent, that's what's important. And so there you have it. Quick video on how we can help our chicks if they have pasty butt. We love our chickens here at Coyote Counters Farm. Um, we also raise hogs. We just added two Nigerian goats today, so that's pretty exciting. We'll do another video on those later. 
but we're happy to share our farm time with you. Thanks for watching our YouTube video and please like and subscribe and pass on to your friends if you find it useful. Have a great day and happy homesteading. Thank mm -hmm. you.